I aren't burnt out anyway. Okay, good. Right, there we have our train. Good morning, driver. Prepare your tank loco and check if you require any water. Please turn your loco around using turn the turntable and make your way over to platform 5. Once you couple to the coaches, you'll be taking your train full of shoppers to Bishop Auckland Market. Right, so, let's bring up that. Do we require any water? Probably. We've only got 300 gallons. But anyway, we're going to stop at Top Bank Hedgeham, which is where? There. And we are there. So we're clear to go back. And let's come quickly, because otherwise we're going to miss that 101. <laughs> Okay, there is no uh, running setting on this, so it's just straight backwards. Let's put on some headlights. That's three. Okay. Well, apart from around the edge of the face, but that's the beard. <laughs> Nice. Over in the background there. Double headed express. I think they were V2s. But I barely saw them as they shot through the station. And stop. You've either got very applied or very released. Right. We're now going to head over to the turntable, I believe. Yep. Well, let's go into forward, shall we? Right, next stop to head on turntable four. We're going to see if we can get some water in. I don't like having so little water. I like to have a couple of thousand gallons rather than just a hundred. Can you get the Royal Scott on train sim? I don't actually know. Isn't it on just trains? No, that's the baby Scott. Have a have a look on JT. Oh no 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 no! Don't go past. Oh, I've gone past. Will it fill? No. Darn it. Need to back up very slightly. Let's put some water in. Pour it straight in the middle on top of the fire. I hear another steamer. There it is. Surprised as it's not, as it seems to be used on lots of rail tours around the country. Yeah, I'd be surprised if it's not at all available. Right, filling up was certainly the right choice to make. A backwards running one. Is that the 4MT? like it. Maybe they didn't have time to turn it around. 
Alright, let's get ourselves onto the turntable. And turn around. Keep going. There we go. Yes, yes, yes. Right, next stop is some kind of head shunt. Comes through. It's it's telling me it's platform head shunt, but hold on. Where have I gone? to there please. Right. Stop at platform shunt, which is where? Oh, okay. All the way up there. We rooted in, that's fine. Right. Let's get on board. Danger live overhead wires. Where? Misleading signs. You can only see the LMS Patriot. Oh, okay. I don't know then. I'm sure as I'd heard of it somewhere, but I can't quite tell you where. Right, we're going over, which is why that lot's on red. You're wondering if Chad at some point when you get a mod can paste the link to my just giving page now and then. Uh, CK Sim, press exclamation charity. Yes, I said the image of making them in 2014, but then uh, stop. Oh, okay. You might want to have a chat with them about what, what's happening with it. Then just send them an email. I found that they didn't seem to mind having emails occasionally. That didn't work for Jill. Possibly because CK had done it. Um, is there a timetable to keep on this one, Chris? Is that a tractor I hear? No, it's a rat. to platform shunt now. Which is just beyond the next signal. It's just up there look. still on the marker. Don't know, but he's waiting for me, so... And no, it's not. Uh, see, I, I would say that normally you'd go past that. Was any of the Class 25 called Roland? Why, Roland Rat?
Nice little photo there. Reverse back and couple to the coaches in platform five. I got it. Don't know who Roland was, but it kind of made sense. The two R's. People do that. Like Arthur, who's an odd Vark. Mr. Harrison prods me and points to CK. It was always on TV AM in the morning. So, okay. Mr. Hello, good morning, Mr. Harrison. Why are you prodding and pointing at CK? people's on. Mr. Harrison hides in the cab. Oh, are you being troublesome, Mr. Harrison? Right, next stop, North Road Platform. It looks as though we might be a bit late, so let's get a move on. On UK... Oh, okay. Nice. I don't know if I trust the freeware stuff. Morning, Ben. How are you this morning? You have snow. Yeah, we just have drizzle. Again, we want to make sure that we don't go smack into that. You good? Ah, brilliant. Right, let's roll. guy that made it seems to make quite a few other nice ones on TS as well. Oh, well, alright then. I might have a look at it. Might, because I've got a number of new Steam Locos to play with anyway. I've got some epic Steam Locos to play with. There's a 2-2... Two -two. Oh, okay. Oh, you might have twisted me on with that one, CK. My arm is well and truly being twisted. <laughs> Be right back, heading for the buffet car. Is that for breakfast, Ben? Uh, CK, can you drop me a, a link in a whisper, please? Oh, on Discord, actually, would be better. If you wouldn't mind. Right, we're breaking for the 20. gonna get but we can be breaking for the stop as we come into 
to North Road. Of late, set some more people's on. Hying to next. Alright, my signal shows clear. For the distance, good. I'm going to need to check the heat now in a minute. Getting cold. Two MT pulling a passenger train, nice. Holding up, holding up the diesel, that's what we like to see. Diesel's been made, made to wait for steamies. Right, I think we better put something on the fire. Okay, we're going to begin a climb. I will be back. There we go, we're back. Yeah, I've headed to the heating car. I've found the steam heating valve. We've turned it on. And I don't have a coaster for me cup. Done the lighting as well. Good call, CK. Good call. Sort that out. Lovely. Done. The light was starting to burn one side of the face. Okay. we doing? Let's not overcook the uh, fire. Right, we're coming, where is Highington? One and a half miles. So we've still got a little bit to go.
just need to move the red can down and so you can see the cap and jinx part of the jumper it's part of it is copped at the bottom we'll get this right at some point today I bet that's gone straight back up again hasn't it right, we'll try that right one and a half miles to Highington There we go. Oh, nice. Right, there's Highington on the hood. I can go down a little bit further actually. Twist it a bit better. Twist it there, twist it there. Right, we'll try that. There we go, it's a bit better. Right, cut, cut off power a little bit. We can put in some water. Mr. Harrison's back. Did you find anything nice in the buffet car, Mr. Harrison? Yeah, so I don't like how I'm framed now. Let's stop at the station and then we'll sort it out. Let's stop at the station. Stop! We're gonna stop. Good. You probably found Nelson in the buffet car with the post office van on the mo motor rail coach behind. <laughs> he says he had some nice breakfast biscuits and a mug of tea. Right, let's actually get this sorted now. It needs to go back up a smidge. That's better. Still, could go up a bit more. There we go, much better. Right, next stop, Shildon. Let's move. Time to move. What is my maximum boiler pressure on this? Let's just drop in the cab, see if we can find out. I can't see. Do we have a light? No. Well, that doesn't help when you can't read the gauge. I don't know. Uh, Gerard, we don't do a show on this show. We just make it up as we go along. If there's anything specific that you want to see, Gerard, let me know. Things that we will be doing include a couple of GT locomotives. The London Transport route, we'll be doing a freight run shortly on the, um, on a route. We've got the Bristol to Swansea extension. Um, that's all in the process of what we need to do today. The problem that I find, Gerard, is that making that requires 
first of all a lot of planning as to what time things are going to be and what time they're going to finish uh, and also just the organisation as to what we're going to do and I don't tend to do that very well but we're on trains all day that I can tell you and those people get really bored of my driving trains and losing lots of points so let's have another snappy snap even give away a couple of Captain Jenks mugs. How is the money raising going? We have 30 quid so far. Which is better than a kick in the teeth. Right, we have a 40 limit coming up. Just keeping an eye on that. Puffin browser, eh? What's that mean, Chris? Right, breaking for Sheldon. Right, I think I found out what the limit is for um for the old. We can use some of that anyway. Don't go through completely. Anybody who wanted to stop at Shildon had better be in that last carriage. We're gonna we're gonna be naughty and back up slightly. I need to put the last carriage on though. There we go. Puffin browser allows users... Oh, okay. Trivia to earn points. Right, next stop, Bishop Auckland for market day. Let's move. About 60. How many tickets per hour? It's one ticket a minute, Gerard. You're sub, so it's 120. 
because you get two per minute for being a sub. Look at um, Chrome on your Android phone. Yeah, I, I can do that. Just look at it on Chrome, Android. You're making a 9F scenario. Nice. Welcome back, Chris. Get moving again. Oh, it's getting nice and warm in here now. Oh, that's so good. Mr. Harrison is also called back. Could I get some trivia questions to earn points? Uh, what type of trivia do you want? in a little bit so we need to just take the, take the edge off that speed going to see what you have in that coffee I hope it's coffee that you have in the coffee general questions about trains I might have to go and get some of my books then The also other awkward thing with that is amending the points because I'm I'm the only one with access to the bot, which will mean that every time somebody wins, I've got to uh, come off and we'll see. You might have the jo bad joke all. <laughs> oh dear. Did you get that from uh, the Rogers Pharmacy? <laughs> right, we got the 15 as we go over all the points. Which will then take us into Bishop Auckland. Hold on, Bishop Auckland should be on there, and it's not. Which means that we've got some manual points to set. No, it doesn't. It means that we're going to hit a red. That's what it means. Let's get watching them signals. Perhaps they they do pun it in as well. <laughs> you tried pursuing trivial, but you could never pursue it as it was a mystery. Right, the distance is on. I I didn't get that one, Chris. I'm afraid that one went over my head. You're okay, got a silly throat cough and silly and have about an inch of snow. Right, this one's red. This one's red. Stop. I don't 
night. No. No, 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 don't go over that, don't go over that, don't go over that. Oh, ho, ho, ho. There's a spad for you. Right, let's back it up. Back it up. Right, I won't tell that I did that if you don't tell. They're not electronically monitored in these days. Nobody knows. Oh no! I know about the board game, but I don't know. I don't understand the 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 mystery bit. You had snowy on Boxing Day. It was huge amounts. It was like I don't know a centimeter. It was gone in an hour. Right, good. We now have the route, the road. Good. You're nursing a minor bout of man flu. Nobody had Twitter either to instantly tweet about it, indeed. Hashtag train fail. Right, we now can go into our platform. Where that other one went then. Doesn't seem to be anywhere around. Right. Because they've done the sound on this to echo, I am actually going to pull right the way through. Stop back out in the open. There we go. The passengers were too busy reading papers to notice, and the children all went, Whee! We're going backwards with the excitement on their faces. Indeed. Mr. Harrison, thank you very much for the host. Well done, you successfully completed this scenario and got the shoppers to Bishop Auckland Market. Well, we didn't hit the other train, that's the main thing. I'm taking that away. That was very good, thank you, Chris. Right, main menu. 